welcome back to another computer sluggish video. Have you subscribed to my YouTube channel yet? If not, be sure to click on the big red subscribe button and click on the bell to get notified when I upload a new video. Also, don't forget to check out my social media channels. In today's video, I will be showing you how to fix any microphone issues you may be having in the new Call of Duty Modern Warfare using the Battle.net application. To start off with, first you need to go down to the bottom right hand corner of your screen and right click on the speaker. You now need to click on open sound settings. And we now need to scroll down and you need to make sure your input is selected on microphone. If you do have other options, then you need to just select each option until you see the test your microphone bar going up and down. As you can see, as I'm talking, it has detected my voice, which is fantastic. It means that my microphone is working absolutely fine and I have selected the correct input device. If you are still having problems, then the next thing to do is simply click on device properties. You now need to make sure the volume is turned up. Mine is currently on 85 and I find that is absolutely fine. You can click on test and just test the microphone. You also need to make sure the disabled option isn't ticked because if that is ticked then your microphone will not work. And you now need to go down to the bottom left hand corner of your screen and right click and then you need to select device manager. Once Device Manager has opened, we are now looking for audio inputs and outputs. And you now need to right click on microphone and select properties. And you need to go across to driver and you need to select update driver. And this will install the latest drivers for your microphone. If that didn't work, then the next thing to do is click on uninstall device and then unplug the microphone and plug it back in and Windows will install the microphone. If that still hasn't worked, then the next thing I would suggest is try a different port on your computer. After you have plugged your microphone into a different port on your computer, then go back through the last things that we just did to see if it has detected your microphone. If it hasn't, then the next thing to do is go to the manufacturer website of your microphone. For example, if you have a Turtle Beach headset that's got a microphone or you have the blue snowball microphone, then go to the website and simply try and download the drivers from their site and then install the microphone drivers. Once you have managed to get your microphone working on the Windows desktop, then we now need to go to the battle.net application and you need to go to the top left hand corner of the application and click on Blizzard and you then need to click on settings. We now need to go down to voice chat and now underneath input device underneath microphone we now need to select the drop down menu and we need to select our microphone. As you can see mine is microphone and if I now go test microphone you can see it has detected my voice. There was a bit of an echo there because I have my speakers on which is absolutely fantastic. You need to make sure the volume is up as well because if that's all the way down, then it will not work. If you do have it set to push to talk, then you need to use that button to talk. Once that is all done, then you are now good to go using the Blizzard application to talk to your friends. You can open up a voice chat with your friends and enjoy a fantastic game of Call of Duty. And I must admit, I really am loving the game. If you have got the game, then comment below. Let me know what you think of the game. I, Like I said, I'm absolutely enjoying it at the moment. I hope this tutorial has helped. If it has, hit the like button below and subscribe for more computer sluggish tutorials. Don't forget to check out my social channels.